<laughs> well, the Mariners lost another crucial game, falling to the New York Yankees 2-1 to one in extra innings. Sports director Julian Minnesota joins, uh, joins us, and Julian, the Mariners have now dropped two games in a row. Yeah, last night's 11-2 beatdown was one of the more lopsided games you'll ever see. Tonight's loss is one of the most frustrating games you'll ever see. We picked things up in the eighth inning. This was the only bright spot for Seattle tonight. Mariners trailing by one, Justin Turner, Turns on that pitch from Clay Holmes, and that's as clutch a home run as you can get. That ties the game at one, and we would go to extra innings. Now in the 10th, Anthony Rizzo up for New York, and that's a little golf swing down the line. That's good enough for a hit and another run as New York retakes the lead. Now bottom of the inning, and this was the definition of frustrating. Runners at the corners for Seattle. Randy Arozarena strikes out, his bat goes flying. Julio Rodriguez is at third, but strays too far away from the base, and he gets thrown out at the base pad. Yankees tag him out for the double play. Rodriguez kicking himself after that one. Now last chance for the Mariners, Justin Turner. He's already homered once, but not again. Turner strikes out, game over, and with the Minnesota Twins losing, the Mariners had a chance to gain some ground in the wild card standings, but instead they remain three games back at that final playoff spot with just 10 games left. And the Mariners will look to avoid the sweep tomorrow. They're going to need to win as many games as possible. That series finale against the Yankees is at 1:10 p.m. Jordan.